Brigadier General John Wharton, Commanding General of the Army Sustainment Command and Senior Mission Commander of Rock Island Arsenal, hosted an installation-wide town hall May 1st to outline his vision of the island. Wharton described Arsenal Island as an Army post with regional and global impact. Not only is it the largest employer in the region with more than 7,700 employees, it also pumps $1 billion annually into the bi-state region of Illinois and Iowa, known as the Quad Cities, affecting 14,000 jobs. He cited 10 major commands here that support military personnel worldwide through manufacturing, research and development, sustainment, engineering, and training missions. His vision is to transform Rock Island Arsenal into the home of Army Logistics through a Logistics Command and Control Center whose mission continues to grow globally. He says this is possible by developing the island's capabilities as Army centers of excellence in information technology, manufacturing technology, and global supply chain logistics. Wharton's plans also include making Arsenal Island into an integral partner of the Quad Cities community by strengthening its partnerships with local companies, small businesses, and local academic institutions. And Wharton discussed the latest developments on impending furloughs for civilian employees resulting from sequestration cuts that went into effect in March. As of now, the number of furlough days remains at 14 starting June 16th. However, Wharton says Department of Defense and Army personnel are looking for ways to prevent this. Everyone around the front of this office and in this room has faced sequestration impacts. And, um, and we, we were glad, glad to know that the furloughs have been reduced from 22 to 14 days, you know, and we hope that they will reduce even less depending on how we, how we move forward. For the Army Sustainment Command Public Affairs Office at Rock Island Arsenal, I'm John Michael Connor.